Sunday afternoon, uh, I think it's what, like 1.30. Um, just loaded up and heading to go cut some yards. Um, so yeah, let's get some, uh, let's go get some grass cut and get some film in since I'm so far behind. Um, I don't want to be out too long today, obviously it is Sunday, so. But yeah, let's go get some grass cut and get some video for you.
yards are pretty pretty freaking wet um, that last one had some standing water in a couple places um, thankfully I didn't track um, that was what I was mainly worried about um, that one I picked up this year it's a weekly yard so that's pretty good um, Pretty loud, um, but I'm heading now back to sort of over near my house, um, trying to get some stuff done. Really, uh, cutting what we can when we can. Uh, it's still got rain in the forecast this week, so that's kind of gonna throw some stuff off. But uh, we got three cut yesterday. I didn't do filming as y'all saw in the video this morning. I just did sort of one take on my phone just to um, kind of do a rundown of yesterday but I'm heading back over back um, now to the town that I live in to knock out a few more I've got a couple estimates I need to get done tonight um, so we'll see how that stuff goes cut if I can. Um, I want to get the one I started Wednesday and wasn't able to finish. Um, I might just have to push mode that one because that one was pretty wet. Uh, and the skag was kind of tracking in some areas so I'll have to walk the property again just to be sure um, that I can that I can at least cut it with the skag. I don't think I'll cut it with a zero turn. I'm not sure. Um, I, that's a new house this year as well. Um, so I don't really know how wet it's really gonna be, essentially. Um, but I mean, the sun's finally out, so that's pretty good. Uh, it's been out all day, thankfully. Uh, it's partly cloudy, so. The grass is starting to dry out, but the ground obviously is gonna take a while. I just saw actually was the second one. The first one I got had all had more standing water. I almost got stuck in one spot, um, and then there were a couple spots I had to push mow, and then there was a whole section I had to weed eat just because I couldn't even push mow it. It was so wet. Um, but they, these people, most of the yards I'm cutting today are just people who have been calling me, like, "Where are you at? Why haven't you cut my grass yet?" So I'm just like, "Whatever. I'm just gonna go Sunday afternoon." And once all the rain's done and get them cut, so, but, um, so yeah, heading to the next one now, uh, like I said, I want to maybe get two or three more cut here, um, in my town, um, and yeah, so, see you guys at the next yard.
All right, guys. So that one's done. Um, I don't know how much y'all saw because my camera died. So I have another GoPro battery um, in the truck. So that battery's dead. This battery is full. I've got one more in this neighborhood to do um, that we were going to try and do yesterday. And then the sky opened up on us. So I just decided to call it a day at that point. I was tired of trying to fight with everything and deal with the rain and all this other stuff so I'm gonna go hit this one and then I've got a yard I need to go look at um, not real sure where it is but since I've got the stuff I might as well go do it and I should have time uh, it's six o'clock now almost 551 don't know if you guys could see that or not um, so I'm gonna cut this one and then we will uh, see about getting the other one done. I don't know if I'm gonna film here or not. Uh, it's a pretty straightforward, small, easy yard for the most part. So, get this one cut. I don't know if she's here. I believe she is. We mulched this one on last week. So it's this house right here on the corner. Uh, I'm just gonna, she has dogs that go in and out. So I'm just gonna start in the front yard and maybe she'll hear me and I can get in the, she can get her dogs in and I can get in the backyard uh, to be able to cut that. So, yeah, maybe I'll get a little bit of filming done here. I don't know. We'll see. So, all right, guys. So, this is the last one of the day. Um, it's a new property. It's only temporary. The house is prepared. I actually, a buddy of mine came with me. Zach, y'all saw him at the GIE. Um, we had this front area. I let him try the V-Ride one. He's blowing everything off now. Um, here. This is how we had to bring the zero turn back here. And this sort of area down through here, there's a big grove that drops off. Uh, we didn't have to cut that, so that was nice. Um, hey, when you blow the patio off... one of the day it's what eight o'clock now yeah 8 13 on sunday so i'm about ready to head home so. all right go get this yard wrapped up and get on home this is the result of a whole lot of rain bank is probably half covered. Can you stop and check it out too? Oh, are they? Oh, <laughs> uh, okay. This is the result of a ton of rain. We've got, what, like a foot and we still have more coming this week? Yeah. I'm pretty sure the bank's probably another 10 foot down, if more, if not more. Judging by where the bushes are, yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah, he is checking it out too. Okay. I feel less bad considering the fact there's no trespass inside. There's logs floating down the river and everything. Alright. We're gonna find pieces of shit. Yeah. Almost lost the nuts. That wouldn't be good. Late sharpening time. We got four, possibly five mowers to sharpen. The mower's a little bright. It's brighter than my future. I feel sad now.
All right, guys. So we are all packed up, and mom's car's back in the garage, and all the equipment's loaded back up in the trailer. Uh, heading inside now. Gonna go grab a shower, throw this video on the editor, and um, start uploading it to YouTube to go live tomorrow. Um, it's kind of dark in here. But walk in here. So, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure you go rate, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you in the next one.